Welcome to the space for transformational leaders to unleash their magic, see better client results, work lighter, and live source. Hi, this is Darla, founder of Sourced, author of Shift the Field. Welcome to our video about creating opportunities to get in the vibration you desire to be in the world. I'm going to say that again. Creating opportunities to get in the vibration you desire to be in the world. So we recently hosted our mastermind retreat called Masterpiece. And this is a program for our high-level clients to really embody who they are as a masterpiece. So we teach something called the Your Sourced Magic. And there's six different magic types and we help people really see which of those are most alive for them and how they work and how they work through them as an expression in the world. Within that, we look at how do you design your business model and your marketing, the when, where, and how you show up around you being most in your magic. Magic is a vibration. When you're in your highest expression of source, you are a particular vibration that's in soul alignment with who you came here to be. And when you're in that vibration, people notice, everything works more effectively and efficiently. You get to work lighter because you're actually a match for the right people and you're not trying to save or fix or be all things for all people in a way that's not aligned with your soul. You're actually going, here's my vibration, come meet me here. Here's my vibration, come meet me here. Now, in the last video, I talked about this idea of having focused attention versus split attention. When you know this is who I am, this is where I want people to meet me, like this, and you wanna hold this vibration and your whole job then is inviting people in to be a match with you and helping them release everything that's not that, right? That's how you get to work lighter. They get to have what you have. You're sharing your magic in the most beautiful way. How do we actually hold this? How do we trust that we can hold this when maybe this was our old reality, right? We've had a transformation, we glimpse this, we say, I think this is possible, but we're not yet embodying that vibration. How do we do that? We've got to put ourselves in environments where we can be this and be this and be this until it is so who we are at a cellular level, until the our ego brain or the hidden commitments we have that have been trying to keep us safe all these years, until they know we are not going to die, we're gonna keep coming down and keep coming down. So we've gotta keep ourselves in an environment where we can hold this high vibration long enough that we know we won't die. It's embodied in ourselves and we can carry it with us when we go back into our environment and we can start to make all the changes we need to make in our home environment in order to maintain that vibration. Now, most people, if they're, this is why I've been a fanatic for hosting retreats for a long time, is because most people, when they're in their regular environment, they see the possibility of becoming more expressed, of becoming more of who they're here to be, of this higher vibration. They can see it, but everything over here is a match for the old vibration. And so it's very, very hard to break free. It's hard to hold this new truth with total certainty when you've put everything in place around you according to the old truth. Now, there's nothing wrong with that you did that. That's what we do, okay? So there's no blame or shame. There's nothing wrong with the things you put in place. And to go to the vibration that's more aligned with who you came here to be as a soul, you wanna put yourself in that experience. That's what we create here at Sourced. So you can definitely check out our offerings and see if there's something that resonates for you. We also certify Sourced leaders. All of our leaders have been trained by us. They're on our website and have different offers in different areas of life transformation or business transformation to support you in being able to immerse yourself in this higher energy and hold yourself here like this is 
the capital T truth. And I'm willing to let go of this small T truth that was based on a lie I believed probably at a young age. I'm willing to let this go so I can go here. And I'm willing to allow a community of like-minded, like-hearted humans to support me in holding this until I have worked the muscle enough that I can hold it on my own. What are you doing to get in that kind of environment? I know personally for me in the last few years with quarantine, you know, working up the willingness to put myself in that environment, to leave the house, to take the step has taken something. And I invite you to consider that it's really, really worth it. That getting in the experience where someone who has crafted this beautiful opportunity for you to be your fullest expression is holding the space and you can just step in and you can get that felt sense of who you really are. Can you prioritize that for yourself in your life? Can you take yourself on retreat? Can you get an experience with a coach, with a mentor who can hold you at where you wanna go long enough for you to work the muscle to be able to hold it for yourself? What are you hearing in this? What needs to go? What opportunity will you step into? I would love to hear. Let me know below this video. I'm Darla Ledoux, founder of Sourced, and we'll see you soon.